Hello again, Mr. Steamed Viewers. My name is Jekyllstein Gray, and uh, um, today we are starting a blind playthrough of um, of my first um, uh, of uh, okay. Whoa, sorry. Um, uh, let's see. We're gonna turn on auto save. I don't know why that's off by default. Uh, nice that they have a color mind mode. Uh, so I've actually never played any of these games before. Um, but I got them all. I got a big, you know, a lot of them and a lot of the DLC in the, um, in a, in the, in a humble bundle. Uh, but I don't know why I'm doing, what is radio? I don't know. This sounds kind of interesting, so I'm going to turn it on. I'm actually gonna turn these on. Uh, yeah, we're gonna keep them all like that. We're gonna connect. We can connect to a Twitter account. What? So yeah, so I've never actually played any trop of the Tropico games before. Um, uh, so. Uh, um. This should be kind of interesting. I I do know that basically all I know about them is they're like a city builder, like a Banana Republic city building sim. Um, uh, you know what? We're going to do the tutorial. So we got quotes from Castro and Putin, so... Yeah. I to take up on just, I'm just gonna put this out there. I have no idea if this is accurate or not, or offensive or not, esteemed viewers. So I would love to hear your thoughts below. Um, uh, but um, uh, we shall see. Uh, I. Um, okay, <laughs> exciting tutorial stuff. You can't do anything without money. Wait, hold on. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hola, Presidente. It is me. Okay, I like that it's not just a, here is how you play, I like how there's actually a, um, uh, um, it's like, they actually give it a larger than life character to teach you, that makes it less boring. That being said, um, I wish there was an option to, like, like, I wish there was a, like, I've never played a game before tutorial, and a, like, I know how to play this general type of game, but I would also like to know how the specifics work. Um, let's see. Click on this task. Alrighty. Whoa. Thanks to our top secret Okay, this is actually really cool. <laughs> I love that there's a uh, I love I love that there's a diegetic exp explanation for it. Um move your mouse cursor to the edge of the screen to I don't like it though when games just suddenly switch di like just just make them say something that makes no sense out if in universe diegetically. You know, sometimes you'll want to take a close Okay, you're gonna zoom in as close as possible. Alrighty. Job, amigo. Now, zoom out. Why would I use the page up key? Now, let's turn around. Hold the middle mouse button. Alrighty. That looks cool. Finally. You can change the angle at which you view your island. To tilt the camera, hold down the middle. Okay. Excellent. 
Now that you know how to command the camera, let me show you how to command time. Wow, command time. I am a very powerful dictator. Uh So Crusader Kings stuff basically. You got normal and then you can pause. I guess spacebar doesn't pause. Interesting. Oh, accelerate to fastest speed. Okay. Time flies when you're having fun. Hey. All, amigo. You are so powerful that you can stop time altogether. Hey, he he stole you stole my joke, Santana or whatever. I can't remember what his name was. You stole, you stole my joke, Generalissimo Santana. Alrighty. This is the info panel. It shows all the important information. Alrighty. Sweatshop. <laughs> will provide you with detailed information about every citizen on your island. Wow. Even their thoughts have been recorded and listed for you to review. So I'm I'm guessing that they're going for a kind of okay. gallows humor type thing. Um, I'm trying to think what a good parallel would be in games. Um, like a dark humor. I mean, Crusader Kings maybe? Wait, political views? Oh no! He wants to be a capitalist! to accomplish your goals and tasks. Let's construct a new logging camp on your island. I love, I do, I do kind of love the dystopian aspect of, like, you can literally, um, alright, right click, alrighty, I'll uh, build one right there. Well done, Presidente. Builders have been dispatched to the construction uh, Things take time in Tropico. I love that. The game is not paused. Again, I have no idea if this if this music is like tasteful or not. Here, we're gonna speed this all up. I really hope my frame rate's not not acting up right now. Probably is though. Should probably work under that assumption. Wow, an island nation of sixty people. It is not very many people. Hey, it's done. Yay! Was by my skills. He even said that in a few years I would be running the Caribbean. I was impressed with the dictatorial powers a presidente has at his disposal. The ability to control time. Alrighty. Mobutu Sese Seko. Again, I probably butchered that. I have no idea who that is. Um, Alrighty, money! Welcome back, my friend. As you know, there's only one thing that makes the world. Occasionally, new optional tasks will arrive on your island. Such events are marked with a large exclamation point icon. Okay. That is a big exclamation well done, point. Presidente. Optional tasks I will say that the idea of this being a state spy satellite, like the, the camera in City Builder games, is going to make me be like, ah, on every other City Builder game. 
accept. Farming is a cheap and efficient way to make money in the early years of your rule. Okay. We're gonna build a farm. Oh yeah, right click. Food and resources. Farm. Okay, so the scroll wheel can alter the, yeah. Sure, all right, we'll build a farm. Production doesn't magically yeah. lead to money, amigo. The Teamsters transport all resources between your buildings. Teamsters visit production re okay. Interesting. Fortunately, you don't have to dirty your hands to construct new buildings. Builders. Uh, I have to pay them more? No. Wait, what? Oh, I was trying to. There it goes. Alrighty. So we're building a farm. Is there anything else we gotta build? What is the entertainment? So some of these are, um, uh, they need a, not electricity. Um, um, a lot of these, um, uh, uh, cosmic pin. Um, RC intellectuals and global tourists. So some of these are, I do have a couple of expansions for this installed. I can't remember which one's exactly off the top of my head. Um, I think that's, that's one of the reasons why I chose to play this one. Um, cause I've got... Tropico 1 through 6? Or no, 1 through 5, I think, installed on my Steam account. Let's see here. So that farm's coming along pretty nicely. We're gonna speed up time here. Um. Pretty big island. Good work. Now let's take a closer look at how farms work. Alrighty, farmers harvest. You can change the crops a farm grows at any time. Your island will usually have a couple of farms built when you take office. Why don't you switch one of them to sugar production? Okay, so we're gonna go from literal banana republic. Um, uh, we're gonna go from literal banana republic to um uh, to metaphorical banana republic. Well done, friend. Now your farmers will start growing and producing sugar. As always, when I talk about these types of issues, um, uh, um, uh, um, feel free to criticize me in the comments below. I welcome any criticism, especially if it's in good faith and constructive. And yeah, they're fifty percent happy. That's okay. Wow, that guy's walking fast. All right, because I sped up time. Let's see here. So I'm enjoying this so far. I mean, obviously, I um, haven't even started the game proper, but um, I don't know. It's It's interesting so far. Oh, my happiness is, their happiness is going down. Oh, here we go. Here are some other tasks. Um, Spacebar does not pause the game. Um, uh, oh no, this place is empty. There's no one to catch fish. Increase the wages a bit. There we go. 
All right, what's this? Mines provide build a mine. My mine. Excellent, Presidente. To ensure that your builders will construct the mine with haste, we need to build a road to the mine. Why do we build the mine? We build the mine to keep us free. Uh, infrastructure, road. We're gonna connect it to. Wow, it moves really fast. Okay, so roads, I guess, are automatically built. Let's see here. Where's the, there's the last one. Uh, almanac. About your financial state can be found in the almanac. The almanac. Except. Okay, here we go. Economy. Well done, amigo. Currently, you are not making much profit. This will change once your economy starts producing. Wow, my economy is not producing anything. Okay. Oh no! This place is empty. There's no one to catch fish. Alrighty. Fine, we'll turn them all up. Um, play. Workers use garages to travel between their workplace. They don't need homes. They can just live in the workplace. The garage in your city to allow miners to get to work quicker. Uh, alrighty. Uh, infrastructure garage. That is a big ass garage. Uh, we're gonna. Now that the wharf is working, let's Alrighty. Cannery. This place is overstaffed. You should fire some of the workers so that we don't have to pay them. <laughs> all right, you're all fired. I don't care what the consequences. <laughs> the empty workspaces to prevent people from taking the newly opened job. Alrighty. Managing your workers will maximize your profits mm, and minimize profits. expenses. Remember to keep an eye on the workers in your buildings. A fully staffed building will produce significantly more exports. On the other hand, employing a full staff. In effect, it doesn't receive real for our resources will only increase your expenses. Alrighty, so that's five out of the eight tasks. The garage is being built. Got the sugar plantations running. Uh, I wanna... Let's see here. It's a nice shot of a... I love the idea of like the spy drone, like, you know, the satellite has to physically move, so like, it, like you have to, like, people are able to see it when I zoom in like this far. They can't do anything about it. I don't know, that's, uh, that sounds darkly humorous to me. Let's see here. Alright, garage is done. Oh, hey, here we go. 
Production change. Economy going, it is best to think about investing in industry. Alrighty, industry, jewelry factory, pay money. I guess it costs a ton of money to buy, build a blue, um, to buy a blueprint. Okay, sure. Okay, I'm actually curious as to what happens when. The, when the population, when the happiness gets too low. I'm presuming it's like, um, uh, they rebel. Um, uh, okay, and we're apparently in the 50s. That's kind of interesting. Um, I'm presuming it'll end in the present era, or the present I guess, when this game is made. Um, I don't know, though. This is one of those series, series where it's like, I have, I've never really heard of it, so like, I'm part of me is like, I can't believe there's like six of these. Um, because if I haven't heard of it, then, um, uh, then no one can. Oh, here we go. Some idiot has built a furniture factory on your island. Isn't that you? With the resources Aren't you the idiot, Generalissimo? Uh, except select the furniture factory. That's not what I wanted. Select the furniture factory. You can't um, um, you lack for your industry. Not really. Allow imports. Allow imports. All right, we have imports allowed. Uh, wait for the freighter. Wow, that freighter's taking a long time. September of 1951. Let's see here. Excellent, Presidente. Wait, since when did I become the Presidente? I thought I was your your protege. Jewelry factory, where it will be processed further. I guess at some point he retired? I don't know. I shouldn't really be, um, be, like, thinking about this. Let's see what's over here. Lots of stuff. Unspoiled nature. Unspoiled nature is unacceptable. We must spoil it. You must spoil the unspoiled nature. Let's see here. What else do we got? Wow, that freighter is taking forever! Oh, is that the freighter? Two months? How long does it take? It? Okay, I guess two months would be okay, but... I don't know. I mean, hold on. The trade page of the Olven okay. detailed information about export trade. Your island is currently importing tobacco, which it doesn't need. You can stop the import. Um uh, Yes, we're gonna forbid tobacco imports. Well done. So this is like a state capitalism simulator, basically. Job well done, Presidente. Managing the economy of an entire island is no simple task. I'll scribe down what I've learned from Generalissimo Santana. I have to remember to develop the natural risk. Oh. I'm guessing Tom Robbins is an anarchist. Too much can have dangerous consequences. Generalissimo Santana warns me that I will occasionally have to meet the demand. Wait, a Turkmen? Was that? I couldn't see who that was, but I'm guessing it was Gurban Guli Birdi Mohamedov. After all, um, someone must work and make money for us. Like the John Oliver, like who John, the guy John Oliver talked about. Explore the tasks on this island. 
to learn more about your subjects and their needs and whims. Alrighty. <laughs> they I want food. I need time off. I want decent working conditions. Just nag, 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 nag. Wow. Wait. Oh, shoot. I didn't want to evict them. Well, I did. The five needs. Food, rest, faith, fun, and health diminish over time. When one of them is low, the citizen will try to fulfill that need. Let's see. Happiness is a fragile thing, amigo. As you can see, there are many factors that form a citizen's... Alrighty, so we have to do a lot of stuff with citizens at a time. Uh, overall happiness. Excellent work, amigo. Use this page. Of All right, what's the lowest denominator? Religion. Well, we gotta give the masses some of their opiates, so let's do that. Food is the most basic of needs. Citizens will make do without food for a time. <laughs> they, they can go hungry a couple nights. It's fine. <laughs> Again, this is this seems to be going for like very a very dark comedy element, um, which sometimes is exactly what you need. Um, let's see. The healthcare on your island is a oh. There are no doctors, and the sick rely on voodoo. Alright, we're gonna build a clinic. We'll build it facing away from the road. We don't want to make the proles too... Um... Uh, too happy now. Food... All right, we're building a clinic. Farm. Fine, you can have some food. Uh, corn. There we go. Clinic's being built. There are three types of people, my friend. The uneducated peasants, High school graduates and college educated specialists. Let's see. Go to high school. Uh, there we go. And we'll just speed up time some more. Is there anything I'm missing? Oh, here we go. Wait, what? They say that crime doesn't pay. True or not, crime <laughs> can become a serious problem for your island. She barking again. Rosie, hush! She's not gonna listen to me. People, crime. The most dangerous areas of your island are marked with red and yellow. The Avatar. I've always said. That if you want something done right, better do it yourself. The Avatar. Yes. Okay, I'm Castro. Why don't you stretch your legs a bit? Oh wow, okay. Pause, pause. This is why this is an RTP game. Apparently, apparently, um... Uh, Here, we're gonna... Build that right there. Um, so... Uh, um, what? Better moving. As you know, the mere presence of El Presidente 
induces awe and fear in the hearts of your citizens. How do I? Okay, here we go. Okay, there's me, I guess. Do you see the icon above your new clinic? It means that there are no. Uh, that's not good. Not a problem. Foreign college educated workers. Let's see. Where was I? Ah, uh, here we go. Where's the clinic? Where did I? There we go. Yes. Yes. No, we can hire a high school educated doctor. As you know, the mere presence of El President. You know, nothing against people who only have high school education, you know, just that you kind of want someone who's gone to med school to, to be operating on you. Uh, let's see. It's over here. There's the shipping docks, I guess. Oh man, I'm pro this is my frame rate's probably dropping so fast right now, but I'm not 100% sure. Let's see here. Wow. That bush. That bush is suspicious. Am I not visiting the restaurant? Wait, am I just like standing in the middle of the road? Oh, there we go. Oh. Right, but don't expect people to become educated overnight. After several months of study. Well done, Amigo. It's interesting. It's interesting. Let's say how there's a gendered a aspect towards these um, towards these jobs. Normally, I would have a problem with that, but considering how the game seems to be priming you. To not take anything, like to 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 view this with contempt. Um, I don't really have that much of a problem with it. But then again, um, uh, then again, um, I I am interesting. I'm interested in hearing your thoughts below. Good work, my friend. The doctors have arrived, and the clinic is up and running. Four slots per doctor. Okay. Hey, there we go. Happiness is a lifelong goal. Keeping the people happy is less trouble. Alrighty. So, um... I, I, I'm gonna admit, I have no idea who Che Guevara is. I might have to look him up. I might have to look him up. Um... Uh, Real politics works. The scheming, the power struggles, and the uh, ooh. Now we're getting to the interesting stuff. So I'm probably going to finish this tutorial and then uh, um, call it for today. Um, uh, There's nothing quite like being in command and holding the reins of power. There's no doubt about it. It's fun to be number one. Yeah, we do not want to get invaded. The Almanac is your best friend. Alright, factions. Politics in Tropico are dominated by eight factions. Communists, capitalists, religious, religious militarists, intellectuals, environmentalists, nationalists, Interesting. and because in the real world, these things are constantly in flux and shifting and gaining power. And there's also, you know, there's no socialists. And there's no, um, um, there's no, um, uh, The respect of a given faction defines how content that faction is. There's no, uh, well, there's no anarchists, because those would just, you wouldn't be negotiating with them. Uh, let's see. Um. What? Oh, wow. Yeah, we need to build some 
some shit to entertain me. Wow, that is a terrible angle. And also here, how do I... There we go. All right, we'll build that, and then... I find foreigners very annoying. Unfortunately, from time to time, you have to deal with the so-called... Okay, so I gotta deal with the US and the USSR. Um... So the USSR likes me. Don't know how to feel about that. Some buildings um, uh, your relations with a foreign power. So basically, yeah. Build a foreign office. Government. Foreign office. Uh, no, we're not going to extend the time. And then what is this? As you may imagine, my friend. All right. Ministry. All righty. Now let's speed up this time. Hey, our citizens are kind of happy. That's cool. Okay, so pulling up the Art Almanac pauses the game. Let's see here. Is there anything else I am missing? Nope. Just a bunch of unspoiled willingness waiting to, wilderness waiting to be spoiled. In some ways this kind of feels like an anti-tycoon game. You know, because tycoon games are, are basically all about the joy of unfettered capitalism and growth. Um, and this kind of seems like it's reframing that in a in a dark comic kind of way. Um, uh, let's see, is that the ministry? Why did the ministry go up Excellent. first? Now that the ministry is built, you will have to hire ministers. Uh, Minister of Defense. Below average, abysmal, and good. Poor, poor, and poor. Alright, yeah. Now that you have a Minister of Defense, you can It is interesting how a, so there's like an objective um, way to be uh, um, uh, to be good. Um, uh, Thanks to your efforts, well done, Prince. The... You've mastered the art of law, man. Um, Good rulers know when to use the correct edict. I gotta say. Uh. Okay. Uh, Swiss now bank account. For the Tropicon Treasury is important. All right. We're going to pause. I don't know what Spacebar does if not pause the game. It is interesting how... Um, uh, it is interesting how... Yeah, no. There are like objectively better people in uh, for certain jobs. Um, uh, uh, okay, that is certainly a drawing of a person, of a character. Um, uh, sure. Uh, gardens. Here, you can have some gardens. Alright, there we go. Um, uh, Gathering money for the traffic. I need a minister of economy, so let's play the game. Everything is so green and beautiful. All right, um, uh, Buena tarde. hello, Ms. Castro. Okay, she's, uh, she is 19 and she's running a country? That is pretty damn impressive. Running a education ministry, I guess. Then again, we are pretty desperate, so... Uh, let's see. 
government. Uh, infrastructure, tourism, shit. Uh, what was I gonna do? Oh, right. We're gonna do this and this. And building permit. Activate. Building permit activate. I don't know. That just sounds like a. a something from, like, a Captain Planet style, which I don't think I ever saw as a kid. But it sounds like something from a Captain Planet style, you know, animated series. Uh, let's see. Good. Bureaucrats in the foreign office have begun inventing new forms. I have learned all. Politics is dangerous. What I find interesting is, uh, what if you, what if you get the U.S. If the U.S. gets angry at you, um, but the U.S.S.R. really likes you, do you start a war between the U.S. and the U.S.S.R.? Is this like Watchmen? Alrighty, um. Uh, so, let's see. Um, but at least it's my hellhole. St. Clara is the typical Caribbean island. Beautiful island. Alrighty, so this is what we'll do next time. Um, uh, St. Clara declared a fourth world country. Ouch. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Turn tropical into a true world power. First things first, improving the situation on Saint Clara. We'll so that is what we will do next time. Um, I actually am interested to see how this like mission structure hangs out. I don't think I've ever played a game like this that a mission structure. We'll see that next time. All right, esteemed viewers. Um, if you um. Uh, if you, all right, looks like it's been doing pretty good. So this is if you've been right. If you're watching this on, on you know unlisted, then it probably is doing pretty good. All right, esteemed viewers, uh, thank you for watching. Um, here I'll pull this up. Uh, if you liked the video, give it a like. Um, if you loved it, um. And you want to see more, uh, subscribe and ring the bell. I, I'm thinking I might do a Phoenix Wright video as my last batch for today. Um, so that might, you get notified of that. I also do want to continue with this. Um, um, uh, yeah, so let's see here. Um, uh, um, uh, and let me think, 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 think. Uh, so there should be some more stuff on, on screen. All the stuff I asked you to do earlier helps me with the algorithm, so I'd really appreciate it. Uh, Twitter and the letterbox and link below. All right, esteemed viewers, I have been Jekyll Stein Gray, and I'll see you later for another video. Bye bye.